Can I call you Rose? Cause you're sweet like a flower in blue. Good morning. Don't mind me. I look a straight mess. Um, you guys saw we've been trying to wake up each morning with the word of God in our house. And I love the fact that, yes, we both have our separate faith journeys, but me and the hubby also, you know, start to watch church with each other more, stuff like that. We were watching it before, but not like now. And it's been feeling so good. I am not feeling well at all today. Um, you guys hear that I'm broken record and all that jazz when it comes to that sort of stuff and my hair isn't done but that's because once I'm done doing all of my important stuff um, I plan on showering washing my hair shaving like getting myself together but also I'm gonna do my eye mask because I'm having a lot of inflammation today and I feel it in my face, I feel it in my stomach, I feel it everywhere, like, um, I don't feel good today. I'd be like that sometimes, but I still got up and I'm still doing what I need to do because I was honestly just laying in the bed. And I said, you know what, you cannot feel good in the bed, you cannot feel good sitting up doing what you need to do. You could just not feel good, but choose what you do in the midst of it. Don't get me wrong, I am going to rest when I need to, but right now I'm to the point where I can sit, at least sit at my desk and get some work done. Oh, Y'all, I was like, let me get on here and vlog because you need to get it together. I haven't been vlogging much and what I've been vlogging has been repetitive. It's me sitting at my desk. It's me in the car, you know, and I need to start showing more. I don't want to become this super boring vlogger because my life is more hectic than I show. <laughs> so I need to get it together. But um, but yeah, I just want to straighten up in here a little bit because in the midst of doing all this stuff, you know, I have clothes that I need to put away. I just, you know, my loved one just folded the laundry yesterday. So I have that stuff to put away that's in the hamper across the hall. I need to organize this stuff. I'm making a recipe book, so I need to start getting that together. But I did also want to look for some more sweaters and stuff for the fall. Even though today is going to be 80, <laughs> um, I still want to prep for fall. Um, I do need some gift bags. Some more gift bags. Because I didn't get them all that day I went to Walmart. So y'all, y'all got to remind me. Y'all got to remind me, but... I'm just about to get myself together like I said do my book stuff that I need to do I have stuff I need to write out important things um, I need to get get things together all these coupons oh. put those away and then yeah so I'm probably just gonna put on some YouTube while I'm writing out this important stuff and then um, uh, writing out YouTube, putting on YouTube, writing out my stuff, straightening up a little bit. I do want to start because there's some recipes in this magazine that I want to add to my recipe book. So I'm going to do that because these books I plan on giving to my girls when I'm all done using them. You know, oh, I have some recipes downstairs I need to add to. When I go downstairs, I'll grab those. Um, but there's some recipes down there that I need to grab. I'm gonna get myself in order so I can shower and relax, okay? I literally was just talking to y'all about vlogging in my office and in the car, and then the first two clips for today is in the office and in the car. But I need to go get some ginger ale for my stomach and there's something else ready for pickup so i said you know what let me go get it now and then i can come back home get myself a situated shower you know all that stuff um so yeah so i was like you know what i'm, I'm just gonna go get it go get it now um and i think i want to stop at ross too while i'm out 
because I want to get a new book for my recipes that I was telling y'all about upstairs because I want to be able to put those recipes away in a sturdy book instead of just a notebook which was which is what I was gonna do I was just gonna put it in a notebook oh I need to throw my flowers away they're dead I forgot to flower them up front and they had heck of drooping they heck of drooping y'all they heck of drooping so but not gonna chat chat y'all all you know chat y'all heads off while I'm in the car like I normally do so I'll just see you guys at the stove let me listen to my my worship music my um elevation church I want to um, Elevation Worship Trust in God is one of my favorite 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 songs right now so if you guys have not heard it I will link it down below oh I absolutely love that song I feel like it could resonate with anybody in any situation I don't want y'all to fall either but Trust in God by Elevation Worship y'all when I tell y'all that song does something to me it does something to me I love it I love it, I love it, I love it. But anywho, let me drive and listen to my elevation worship. <laughs> would actually be a perfect for a cookbook. Oh, I like that. But I wouldn't use it. But I absolutely love the cover. This is so beautiful. It says, For I know the plans. Jeremiah 29 11. It's a weekly planner. If it just said that, I'd be happy. to my full potential and yes you guys are seeing me back in my office this is just where I work so if I am recording in here it's because I'm working but um but yes I'm I definitely want to be recording more and doing a lot more I could be doing a lot more and if I spend less time on screens where if I spend less time scrolling through TikTok watching YouTube I have more time to focus on 
creating better content, editing better, um, you know, reading and researching more to learn new things to help my editing, you know, like as far as marketing, as far as, um, you know, new edits, things like that, you know, I want to focus, I want to put more focus into it, you know, you guys are my baby, you guys are, are my first love, so I want to put more love into you, I've been, I haven't been doing enough, you know, so, but yes, I am going to get into reading my word for the day, it is 540, 543 I've been up for an hour um and that's another thing I want to get back on track I was getting up at 5 a.m a lot of the mornings lately I've been getting up at 8 38 7 38 o'clock that's that's not me that's not me so I set my alarm and I got up I did reset another alarm for 5 30 but I didn't even have to use it I ended up staying up I ended up like doing my guided prayer in the bible app Today there's an appointment for my loved one this morning so we will be going to do that and then um so we'll be going to do that and then my goal is to come back here and do some work I air I didn't even show you guys what I got yesterday when I went to TJ Maxx I got a bunch of notebooks this one is gonna be a recipe book um this one Oh, it's gonna be like my new bill book um, because it has like tabs and stuff you guys can't see in there but there's like tabs and stuff so this is gonna be my new bill book um, this was just a random book that I got um, I do have a prayer journal already which is like right behind you guys so I don't really need a prayer journal but um, maybe I can do this and put like you know, I can speak things into existence, you know, like maybe I can make this my manifestation journal, like, um, you know, my talk to God about what I want and what I would like to gain through him, you know, whether it be f spiritually, mentally, emotionally, you know, all that stuff, but it's up in the air. I thought this was so cute. It's got a little mu mushroom on it and it's like this almost feels like pleather it uh i love me a good notebook i'm a i love me a good notebook <laughs> notebooks yeah and this one i just thought was beautiful and i love like this forest green color i just thought it was so beautiful a lot of these were reduced price so i got a lot of these for i think i got all these notebooks for less than ten dollars Normally it would have been like five dollars, three ninety nine, stuff like that. But it was like one ninety nine and two forty nine, so a lot of these were reduced. But I have stuff in these little notebooks that I'm going to transfer into these bigger notebooks, and I'll use these little notebooks for like, you know, how you keep like a notebook in your bag type of thing to write stuff out. Like I'll probably just use it for that. But anywho, let me read the Bible and get my day started um, oh there was let me see okay so today's guided prayer is about God's truth and knowing um, how God is working in your life even like even though people will say you know um, you know why would God put me through this if he you know loved me um like that lie that people tell themselves but god's truth is to know that god causes everything to work together for his glory and for my good romans 8 28 god's grace is sufficient for me and his power is and his power is per, um, perfected through my weaknesses second corinthians 12 9 um the lie that we tell ourselves i will always be this way God's truth I can change because I belong to Christ the old me has gone and the new me is here I love that especially for this new path that I am now on um, thinking through the lies you believed it's easier to entertain lies when you allow them to become a part of us but once you recognize the lies you've internalized you're halfway to victory because you acknowledge those but God gave us his word so that we can know the truth and his truth is what sets us free so if you guys needed a scripture to go to you know read 2nd Corinthians 517 
2 Corinthians 12 9 and I'm so excited like I'm getting closer to the halfway mark in this Bible I'm about 35% into it I'm so excited but but yes have those instill that in you guys we all can change for the better especially when we have God guiding our paths so let him guide your paths guys um Let's see, October 1st. Thank you, God, for allowing me to see a new month and the final chapter of the year. Praying it's filled with blessings, new opportunity, good health, more money, love, healing, and more wins for all of my family watching. Um, Lord, please guide us into this new chapter for ourselves, whether it may be getting back into something that we used to get into, whether it's um, trying something new, whether it's, um, you know, overcoming just little trials that we may be going through, Lord, just guide all of us through these moments, Lord. And I know with you, everything is possible. Everything is possible. And Lord, thank you for the people watching this. Thank you for bringing them over to my channel, letting them get to know little old me. Um, and yes, we give all we give you all the praise, God. In your mighty name we pray. Amen. Amen. Okay, let's get started with our day. <laughs> regrets. This woman had regrets. I'm sure she regretted every day. <laughs> in the house is awake after I cleared off my couch in my office I just decided to get dressed and come out to the grocery store I like going out early 
because it's less crowded and I can get in and get out, you know? So I'm just gonna head to the grocery store. I'm gonna get some breakfast type things because we don't have a lot of breakfast stuff in the house. Oh, this is dangerous. Oh, okay. I had to pull up closer to the curb, to the intersection because the sun is rising and it was right in the path of being able to see if there was cars coming. So I have to be careful. I need to get a new tripod, you guys, for when I'm out and about like this. I would like to find a small one for my phone when I don't want to bring my big vlogging camera to where, you know, like maybe one of those gorilla ones where I can bend the uh, stand to like fit on a, um, a shopping cart and stuff or one that has a clip on it that I could clip to the shopping cart. So when I'm out and about, it'd be easier to like vlog instead of putting like my phone or my camera on a shelf and then walking, you know, I want to be able to have, you know, more stability and keep my camera closer, you know? Anywho, okay, let me put on my sunglasses, y'all, because this sunrise is getting to me. Hopefully by the time I leave the grocery store, it's more up so it doesn't, because like right now it's right in the eye, eye line, like, so it's bright. It is bright. It's so hazy out this morning. I don't even know if you guys can tell. It almost... It almost looks like the dollar store is on fire right here because of y'all see that haziness right here it's crazy let me see if i can turn the camera around like there's a haziness coming from the sunrise and it makes it look like the dollar store is on fire i've watched the dollar store actually be on fire i hope not but yeah see how it's just these little bit of cars in the parking lot this is why i like coming early in the morning just literally workers and vendors stocking the shelves and there's not many customers in here which I really like that's why it's good to shop early in the morning y'all but I got my bacon I need eggs orange juice and pizza rolls and then I'm done um I my loved one a soda real quick luckily they like zero so oh let's see dang they're not on sale anymore why is it only the two liters that are on sale? Two liters and the cases. Don't make no sense. Oh, they just need one to last them a few days. One a day, that's six days, that's a week. So that's good, but okay, I'm gonna finish shopping. <laughs> Y'all know what I forgot to do? I forgot to take the wheelchair out the trunk. I forgot to take the wheelchair out the trunk. So, now I gotta put my groceries around the wheelchair. 
I'll take it out when I get home. <laughs> Stuff that happens when you're a caregiver. And then I'd be mad if I had something big to put in my trunk right now. Oh, I'm trying to hold out on the bread and the eggs. I don't want to crush them. For some reason I thought I thought the hubby took it out the car yesterday but he didn't so man this sunlight oh it does the skin so good doesn't it I love it <laughs> okay let's go home guys put these grace groceries away feed my family get meds in the miniature and then I would like to watch a movie there was an ad I saw on Facebook for an old movie from like 2013 or something called 23 Blast. And it's about a... Did you guys really think I was going to give you a spoiler alert? Nope. Go watch it. It was really good. Um, definitely, definitely recommend. It's on different platforms and I watched it on Netflix. So that's where you can find it. Check it out. With the update, it allows my it allows my phone to still continue to record even while playing music. What? Before I used to cut y'all off. I can't believe it. Mm, hey now, <laughs> but but I'm on the freeway. I'm gonna drive home so I can get these groceries there and be able to chill with my loved ones and just relax. Hopefully, there's not much to today. I would like to. Um, start uploading footage to edit so I might do that but I'll chat with you guys when I get home hey guys I'm downstairs I'm just making some chili as you guys see just letting the liquid cook down in my ground turkey and then I'm gonna put everything in the slow cooker right here um I've read that it's best to cook your meat first to give it that flavor with the seasonings before adding it to your chili. So that's what I'm doing. I've made chili before, but I normally just make it on the stove and not.